Hey YouTubers, uh, this is a middle of the week video. It was gonna go one way and it took another turn. Um, gonna wake up this morning, I was going to you know, thank my new subscribers, I really appreciate the support. Uh, I was gonna talk about all the stuff I picked up at Ross yesterday. Um, you know, Power Rangers and Ultimate Spider-Man and uh, some Thanos figures. I gave $5.99 a piece for all those, and they're all selling for well over $20, so I got those listed last night, uh, as well as a Star Wars Riot Baton, which that one I paid up for. I gave 45 for that, and I have it listed on Marketplace and eBay right now for $100. Um, and then when I came downstairs, disaster. <laughs> uh, came downstairs to the entire downstairs flooded. Uh, I am sitting in a puddle of water right now. Luckily, 99% of my store merchandise was off the floor, on shelves. Um, most of my electronics are off the floor. So I managed to avoid a lot of expensive damage, but there is still a ton of cleanup here. Uh, I'll do a video, show you around, show you everything. Uh, just got back from the store, picked up 20, uh, 20 towels and some squeegees and mops. Uh, <laughs> get the, uh, I'll get, get some fans going, get the blower going, get these rugs rolled up and out of here. And uh, probably be talking to an attorney since none of this flooding was disclosed by the previous owner who lived here since the house was built in 1975. So uh, it was definitely known about. But uh, let me show you around, show you everything that happened. So as you can see, I've already got a moving blanket down, trying to soak up oh, some of the water. I uh, got all the vintage luggage I had stored underneath. I got that up off the ground. The original cardboard boxes that they were in um, are completely destroyed. But they were crumbling anyway, so I'm not really heartbroken about that. Luckily, all of the Playboy Bunny ashtrays and lighters were in a plastic tub off the ground. All my moving supplies were up off the ground. Um... Baseball bats, they needed to be washed anyways. Uh, got the surround sound just propped up off the ground a little bit. Came downstairs and it just became an immediate uh, like scramble to try to get... Yeah, I'm squishing as I walk here. Just an immediate scramble to try to get everything off the ground, get electronics unplugged that were on the ground. I mean, you can ah, you can see that it's really bad. Luckily, the tiling in the garage was done along the other side of this wall, so this side did not get as bad as it could have. Um, and as you can see, all the merchandise, you know, boots, but that just cleans the soul, so can't complain. Um, posters didn't get damaged, as far as I know, which is good. The Beanie Babies have all been individually bagged, so I was able to get them up out of the way. Um, and we'll walk through here. Can't really assess... There's all the towels I just got. Can't really assess the, uh, the damage in here. I mean, I know water came in, but I've got all the MREs stacked up in here, so really can't see how bad it is. I mean, you can see the reflection of the lights. All of my pictures and portraits that are going up in the garage were leaned up against this wall, so they've got some water damage now. Luckily, I do not keep tools on the ground in my garage, with the exception of lawn equipment that I was using. 
but as you can see, it's actually in one of the few dry spots. But yeah, it's uh, it's bad. Could be worse, I suppose. My uh, new garage door opener is soaked. Hopefully, that doesn't ruin it. Tiles are uh, all a little wet. Hopefully, when I am done with this garage, this won't happen. I hope. But this is a long, strenuous process of tiling down here. Utilities room is flooded, so any drywall scraps that I had. Oh. Yeah, anything that was touching the ground in here is pretty much ruined. Septic tank smells like it uh like it's full of water. I'm smelling the uh the sewer in here. Luckily, all of these boxes look to be dry and safe. Um, looks like the water went right up to the tile, and if it went under the tile, it didn't go over the tile. Down here, at least, which is good. Um, didn't have as much luck with the tile up here, but this had a lot heavier flooding. I was supposed to get a new driveway at the end of September and no call no show from the driveway paving company so that probably would have helped divert a lot of the water that actually came in here so I'm gonna focus on the eBay room get the rugs out of there um, try to squeegee as much water out as I can. Get the rugs hung up over the fence to dry. And then do a uh, assessment of property damage. See if I need to make a claim or not. Um, luckily the luggage that did get wet was hard plastic luggage. So I don't think any of that's damaged. Uh, it'll be an assessment of any electronics I had on the ground, a vintage radio I had sitting there. But, I mean, it's up on legs, so it should be fine. Uh, that cabinet back there is probably ruined. The couch, I'll have to flip it over and start drying the bottom. But, yeah. Ugh. So one of the packages I had slotted to go out or had packaged up to go out, um, bottom of it got wet. Luckily, it was just a plastic uh, Nerf bow, um, so it won't be destroyed or damaged. Uh, the rest of the packages, I, I just got back from the post office delivering. They were in a post, uh, post box up off the ground. So none of them were damaged or hurt. Um, but enough about the woes of, you know, 2020. That's why I'm not even really surprised that this happened. It's, you know, it's 2020. But I do want to say, um, excuse me just a moment. Sorry, that was my realtor calling. Um, just uh, you know, let me know if I am gonna make a claim to the insurance company. Uh, just document as many pictures of the damage as I can before I clean it up. But like I said, enough about the woes of the flood here. Um, I do want to say thank you to my new um, subscribers. Uh, let's see. I am now up to 19 subscribers. Uh, I mean, that's up from 10 that I had last week, so that's good. Uh, let's see. New subscribers. Um, 
Shout out, thank you to the smaller half, Scorpion King Gaming, uh, Miss Nita Boo, and Life and Stuff. Uh, Blue Chaos. That's all the ones it's showing me, so if I missed you, I apologize. Uh, but just know that I am thankful for your support. <sighs> yeah, so. I think I'm going to have a drink for the first time in... Uh, nine months. <laughs> but... Oh, um... I'm going to I'm not going to be yard selling tomorrow. I believe with the weather that's been going on, there are none listed for tomorrow. So what I will actually be doing is I was watching Harry Tornado's um video, Josh's video, and a new uh a new Amazon bin store actually just opened up in Columbia, South Carolina, uh Crazy Caz Boys. So I will be jumping in the car about 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning and driving over there to try to get an early spot in line by about 5 a.m. They open at 9, so it's going to be a little bit of a camping trip there. But uh, based off of his video, he spent about 200 bucks and had well over $800 in profit. Um, tomorrow's their $7 per item day. So because there's no yard sales, I need something to do. Uh, I'm going to employ the help of one of my friends uh, so I can get two carts going, try to uh, double my profit uh, more than it would if it was just me. So you will see Crazy Cats Boys in Columbia, South Carolina tomorrow, and hopefully we find some good stuff. Uh, you know, if you like if you like my videos, please hit that like and subscribe button, uh, hit that thumbs up. It means the world to me, and uh, it really helps me out. Uh, and, you know, you can see all the stuff I picked up on the eBay store, which I will provide the link in the description down below. Try to show you everything I got yesterday. Really, I went in there just for one item that I found, which was uh, a metal figure Thor. And then I ended up scanning Thanos and saw that he was selling for about $20 plus 8 shipping and he only cost $5.99. That led me to scanning a bunch of the toys. But this is not the way I wanted to spend my 28th birthday. <laughs> but it's all good. It's just water. It cleans up. Um, you know, so I'm going to get started on cleaning that up. Maybe grab a bite to eat. Have a drink. And I will see y'all tomorrow.